Hello, good day guys. My name is Sarafa and welcome to another edition of the Safe Power tutorial. So today we'll be talking about um, how to complete the setup, security setup on the Safe Power app just before we create or import our, our wallet. So we quickly open the Safe Power app. So this is the first um alerts you get when you open the app just after installation safe power would like to send you notifications notifications may include alert sound icon badges this can be configured i'll click on allow so as if i make any transaction or i receive any token i get uh, a prompt that something has um, been done on my account so we just click on this you can read the terms and condition you can read the terms and condition before you click on yes i accept so then you click on get started so today we just want to talk about how we set our security password just before we import our wallet maybe create or import wallet so we've got two options on setting the pop-up security the first one is the digital which consists of just numbers as you can see on the screen and also we've had uh, we have uh, another option of using the hybrid password where we, if we click on this use a hybrid password it's going to bring this option where we can use both the um, alphabet or numbers or symbols so i'll uh, just go back to use the digital password which is here so that's it so we read uh, what's on the screen create security password the security password is used to unlock wallet approve transaction access mnemonic phrase remember it tightly and do not give it to anyone safe power does not store or access your password please remember it tightly and do not give it to anyone so i'll just quickly set up a digital password i will do one five nine one five nine so that's when true it's going to ask you to repeat the password again one five nine one five nine yep so now it's asking me to set up my face id but i'm gonna skip it so we can get back to that when we get on the following screen just after this skip so congratulations you are now ready to start the safe power journey safe power will not store your password pin code private key or mnemonic phrase please store this critical information with secure method and do not disclose to any third party um, just like we've done in our previous video, it is not advisable for you to store your passphrase online, um, maybe in your drive, just because if your um, your um, email gets hacked or something, they could get to you, they could get to these phrases. So it's advisable for you to probably get your diary or maybe an offline um, back up maybe on hardware or something and store your phrase so it has brought us to this page where it says safe power add the wallet to start your crypto journey uh, software wallet hardware wallet so like i said earlier this um, video is just to talk about how to add our security just before we import or create a new wallet so look at the top left hand side we click on the settings button so this is the security we click on security so we have two options here we have the pattern unlock and face um, id so we click on the pattern unlock if that's what we want to use instead of a digital password we click on this we click on pattern unlock so it's going to ask us to impute our digital password click on the digital password so i create my pattern it's gonna ask me to redraw the pattern i draw it so that has been 
set so let's see how it works um, I'll click on it so now it's gonna ask me to impute my pattern or a digital password whatever medium we want to make use of so I'll use the pattern just run my pattern so it has gone through let's look at the other option which is the face ID click on the face ID um, click on security the face ID so now it has two options asking us which of the options we want to set this face ID for is it only for login or to initiate or carry out a transaction that's for signature I'll click on the login first so yes that has gone through and if I want to just for the signature as well instead of me imputing my digital password or um, pattern or just click on this so it's going to make use of the face ID to make transaction more easier so let's go come back here I use the face ID if I don't want to make use of the face ID I'll just click on this so I want to make use of the face ID I can make use of the pattern I'll click um, so that has gone through then let's use the last option which is the which is the security so that's it so that's how to set up your security just before you create or import your wallet and if you want to turn it off back you come back here go to security click on pattern you can change your pattern if you want and you can turn it off if you turn it off it's going to ask you for this so that has been turned off and also um <clears throat> you can use the auto sign in option as well in auto sign in mode you can sign transaction without authenticating after signing the first transaction in a specific time frame auto signing only works on software wallet auto signing does not work when biometric verification is enabled so that's for that that's if we maybe sign in a transaction with our face id or pattern or digital code it's going to take a, maybe if you set within three minutes so within that three minutes you initiate another transaction it's not going to ask for this um it's not going to ask for verification like pass the passphrase um the passcode i mean sorry to say the passcode or face id or pattern unlock just within the time frame at which you've set here so um and also the auto lock why i did set it to immediately is this so whenever it is i exit the safe power app whenever it is it i exit the safe power app and i come back in i need to impute the password just for security purpose so we can turn this off as well if you want turn it off and put your passcode you can turn it off if you want put your passcode so whenever we just exit we come back here we just put our code so that's it that's how to set up your security um the security password just before you import or create your wallet so thanks guys for watching catch you in the next video bye bye